Does offering more veg options increase the number of people who eat veg foods, or does it just give more options to the people who would have eaten veg anyway? A study of dining halls at Cambridge University can help us answer this question. In this study, researchers observed two dining halls, A and B, over the course of three terms with almost 87,000 purchased meals. They didn't alter the menu plans of the dining halls, but instead counted how many veg meals were available at each meal time to see if the number of options had any effect on consumer choice. They found that when half of meal options were vegetarian instead of a quarter, veg sales were 62% higher in dining hall A and 79% higher in dining hall B. Total sales were relatively unaffected. Since the first study was correlational, the researchers then conducted an experiment on a third dining hall where they actively changed the menu to ensure that the menu changes caused the change in sales rather than some other difference between meal times. They found that doubling veg meal availability from one quarter to one half of the meal options resulted in a 41% increase in veg meal sales. Like the first study, total sales were not affected. This study shows that simply offering more veg options can increase veg meal consumption. Making veg meals more available in public cafeterias, dining halls, and canteens may be an effective tool for reducing meat consumption through consumer choice.